Good morning, mademoiselles and messieurs, mystery men, 64 at your service, and welcome back. Pokemon Firebird Bourbon. Pokemon Bourbon. Okay, so let's go ahead and sell my... All the things that I don't need, like these nine nuggies. Ba boom! Man, I might fly back to Celadon just so I can buy some other stuff. Because I don't quite want to buy max potions, so I'm gonna do just that. I'm gonna buy a whole bunch of crap while in Vermilion, not in Vermilion. Celadon, because it has the marked. And lemonades. Doo doo. Okay, where's the one with the normal healing items? You're the TM person. Are you also a TM person? You don't even have hypers. Okay. I'm just gonna buy hypers at this point because even though lemonades are technically more cost effective, I'm lazy. So I have to. If I had to guess where hypers were, because instead of being based off of badges, which is a smart thing to do, they're based off of location, which is stupid. And I hate it. Heck. And then let's throw away half my money to get 30 of those. Pretty much whatever my nuggets gave, I just threw right back in. Good. Great. I'm glad we did this. We were here to experience this together. So thankful that you're all here. To watch me flounder around. Truly. A work of miracles. Okay. Island. There's a new encounter on Five Island. Yes, there's a new encounter on just Five Island. It is in the water. Yeah, I know. Weird, right? But there is a new encounter. Let's go over it, shall we? The only new encounter on this route is Hopip, a flying grass type, a unique typing, as well as its evolutions going into Skip. Bloom, also a flying grass type. Again, unique typing, not many have it. And its final evolution in Jumpluff. It mostly excels in speed and not much else. Outside of having a unique typing, it doesn't really accomplish too much. Grass flying is the most common type of the world, nor is it the most useful in the world. It's here, I guess, if you need it for something. I don't, but if you do, it's there, I suppose. And that should pretty much do it for the encounters at Five Island. And now back to the present. But wait, there's more. We have even more encounters. You're not done future me, you silly person. More encounters, go. Yay. We have Sentret, a normal type Pokemon, as well as its evolution in Furret, also a normal type Pokemon. It's very good for learning HM moves, and I want to say it usually has the pickup ability, which is incredibly useful. This is just a very useful HM Pokemon. Also, it just happens to have Furret Dance, uh, or Furret Walk, so, you know, there's that. It's our special boy. 
Next up, we have a Fire Red exclusive water encounter in Quillfish, a water poison type. It's stats are left to be desired, but it's interesting. Thankfully, it has its Hisuian forms, but that doesn't exist and won't exist for a very, very long time. Doesn't evolve, and it's just kind of here. It has a decent attack stat, but oh well. Next up, our Leaf Green exclusive water type in Remoraid, just a pure water type, as well as its evolution in Octillery, like artillery. Its stat spread is more like a mixed attacker, which is surprisingly good. It has a surprisingly decent stat spread. Of the two, unsurprisingly, Leaf Green has the much better encounter. It also has a pretty unique move in Octzuka, which is like a 110, 120 power water type move that's on very few things and it's like a signature to this overall pretty decent water type if you need it pure water which is a uh, great typing and uh yeah it's just uh, pretty good and i believe that should pretty much do it for the encounters on this route we're almost done we're almost done with the encounters we're so close we're almost at the end okay Back to the present now. Okay, now we're done for encounters. For a decent while. Until we get to a certain location, and then it gets interesting. Jesus. Uh, Scar, because you need the levels. But now I have revives. The difference being, I can revive now. Yeah, 3,000. That gives me money. Of which I need to buy more revives. Well, at least doesn't use it up. Thanks, game. That wasn't entirely sarcastic, but also mildly sarcastic. Oh joy, these things are like level 14, 50. So instead of repels working, it's just like, nah, son. You don't get the luxury of not running into encounters. Oh boy. It's funny that I have that. I might, I, I don't actually know if I will. Go Scar, because you're a poison type that doesn't care about poison types. Which... useful. Earthquake! I wonder how these few battles are going to go. Because the answer may not surprise you. The answer is Earthquake. In case you didn't know, the answer's going to be Earthquake. It's always going to be It's just too good. Earthquake, you should use it. I do know this thing cuts me out at a certain volume, so I need to be careful about using the quiet voice. Yeah. Close to the microphone. Can hear it. Could anyone hear it? Me whispering into the microphone. I don't know. I have it so it doesn't really capture uh, any clicks or button presses. Because, you know, might as well say this in terms of recording purposes. Yeah, I'm using emulators. It's just easier. It's just significantly easier to do. Because I don't 
trust because if I were to get like a DS 3DS capture, I'd have to either A, send mine to be modified or order a modified one. I'm just like, nah. Nah, I'm good. I'm good with just dumping the games and emulating. I'm, I'm all right with that. Um, I'd prefer that. Thank you. It's easier to record this way. There's a legal way to do it. Of which I will not tell. But there is a legal way to do it. Let it be known. And again, Nintendo doesn't sell this game. They're not making money from this game. If I were to buy this game, it would be from a third party that will not go anywhere near Nintendo and they can mark it up to be whatever price they want. So, you know, there's also that. Also, Paris Song is funny. Not learning it, though. I'd rather not. Like... I will support games, you know. Folding need log, yes not, nah, Chansey. Open the door, get on the floor. Rocket Warehouse, woo! Oh wow, more spinny puzzles. Okay, I mean, I'm just gonna keep doing that. Oh! Can you get Porygon 2 and Z? The reason I didn't go over... <sighs> there might be another one. I have to add to the asterisks of ones that I've missed. I can't keep track of them all. Because I don't know what you actually can and can't have access to in these games. I don't have that part memorized if you couldn't tell because you know evolutions are locked behind national decks and you don't get national decks until post game or if you catch a certain number of pokemon so you know hundor a pokemon i wish desperately that i could use nope and in the second gen <laughs> Oh, I would love to use this in second gen if I don't land on the fire type, but uh, too bad it's not available until post game. Why? That's not a joke. Hundor isn't available in all of Johto when it is a gen 2 Pokemon. Available Nowhere in Johto. You have to go to the Kanto half of Gold, Silver, Crystal and its remakes for Hound Hour. It is the stupidest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. And why you would design it that way is beyond me. Okay, so now the hard part of trying to figure out how to get where I need to go. <laughs> yeah, because this is the annoying part of needing to go down the right paths. Okay. That oh, wasn't it either. Oh my god. You know, it would help if I could see the full map layout, but I can't. Okay, that seemed to help moderately. Okay. 
Machau. Da 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 Paterans. Oh, Patui. Oh, spoiler alert. That's such a good game. Too bad it's stuck on the 3DS with crappy controls. Granted, with emulation, I kind of have a pseudo twin stick version of it. So I can kind of play it in twin stick, which is the optimal way to play. Get a curse uprising. Might need to up the sensitivity a bit though. But it is pseudo twin stick. Because, you know, I can map the stick to the button so that when I put the stick to the left, it's the leftmost button. So it goes left and I have pseudo twin stick. It's not perfect, but arguably better. So now I need to get over there. In order to get over there, I need to... This one. Okay, not that one. Not that one. Uh, I just said not the one I wanted to go. Actually, hold on. I think I've got this all wrong. First off, let's obtain this. And then we do it this way. So that then we can, yep, there we go. And nope, that was in fact not the answer. Okay, I see the answer now. I see the solution before me. I know where I'm going now. And it's this one. Because then, I'm here, and as long as I move very carefully, lets me come up here. Sludge bomb! Yay! I've solved the puzzle! Keep no. I hear that I still have nothing. No answers. Okay. We're just gonna ancient power for the Omni chance. Being real, you fool, you've activated my trap card. You've activated my trap card. Now it's out of confusion, and you just increased my attack by two stages, uh, for free, my dude. Thanks. So if I wasn't one-shotting your next guy, I am now. Oh, and I got an Omni, so now I'm at plus three attack, plus one, everything else. 
Sweet, dude. Pretty sweet. All 41 on him. And Paterance is not quite 56, but it will be. That was another Hypno. And just danger power again. Plus three, dude. Because <laughs> it's physical in this game. And there are good things about rock being physical. That means uh, it can properly use ancient power where it changes to special to where it then can't. So, you know. There is always method to the madness. Wow, Team Rocket admin. Wow. That sounds pretty special, my dude. Yeah, after this, I only have uh, seven islands, and then I'm pretty much done with the Sevy Islands. So I'll finish this little bit up and then end the episode. Oh, thank you, person with loud car. Preach that. I probably captured. Can't exactly help it. You know, it's a thing that happens in towns and cities. Cars, they exist. Uh, we're just gonna thrash at this point. Probably was a mistake that I didn't just EQ stab, but uh, I thought this way was funnier. Checks out though, not what I wanted to do. I was mashing A. That was my fault. I have no one to blame but myself for that. Now I'm parafusioned. Which one happens first? The attack going through. Okay. Sure. Scar has been killing it lately with those coin tosses. I'll say that it has been killing it with the coin tosses. Fly, you fool. And it's a 2,000 and 3,000 cash. So we're just going to um, revive uh, Star. Because it's going to hard carry this next battle, and it will be the last battle. Woo! Team Rocket Admin. Just a basic gold bat, like every other Rocket member. Wow, that sure is an admin who's above all the other admins, isn't it? Oh, a little bit longer than I would like, but I did want to try to uh, at least get close to finishing this island. Then all I have left is seven island of the Sevy Islands, and uh, Well, more or less be done. Ancient power because still stab in Omni Chance. No Omni though. Sad day. Sad day indeed. Wheezing. Ancient power Omni Chance.
Brit. And return from you should do it. Yeah, you're gone. Giovanni's badge. Yep. Yeah. Three thousand five hundred. And the warehouse. And then this scrub lord. Let's trigger more people, scientist Jidian. Ah, that's the one uh, Scar's going to carry because electric types can't do jack. Got two though. Uh, let's bag and. I don't need that. I just need. Yeah, ether with EQ. EQ restored. Again, wish you could just buy those. Don't know why you can't. Later, it becomes more efficient to just grow and harvest leopard berries because those do the exact same thing, but they're infinite because you can grow them. You just can't in this one. Porygon. Wow, you traced my poison point. Too bad you're normal type. There it goes. Electrode, which we're just going to EQ, and we at speed. Then again, we are also 10 levels higher. It's gone. Yeah, for some reason, I, I have, like, stats for this guy of what his Pokemon has, and I was like, wow, he has a surprising amount of Pokemon. So I have, like, the Pokemon stats, but I'm just like, eh. Not important enough. Plus it just has normal music and it's just all electric types, which... Yeah, if you couldn't tell... I had the only answer I'd ever need. Woo! Level 57! Almost level 60. Darn, darn, darn. Yay, we got it. But, I believe, this will end things off here, so... There's only a little bit left of the Sevy Islands. There's still some post-game left, and... After we're done with the Sevy Island comes the monolithic grind. Because, uh... What levels do I need to be coming up? Jesus. For context, comfortably, I would want to be level 60 to 65 on everyone. Preferably 65, but yeah. As always, I'll see all of you in the next one. Until then.